And so, but get this, this is the crazy part. This is something, when I was reading this, I was like, what? So this study about neural imaging, neural imaging um, during trance states, right? Um, it says there is, during a trance state that there are changes in brain activity, including increased connectivity in certain regions, uh, like the posterior cingulate cortex insula and the anterior cingulate cortex. At the same time, there can be decreased connectivity in the auditory pathway, suggesting perceptual decoupling. These network reconfigurations suggest an amplified internal mental stream that may occur alongside a suppression of external sensory input. External sensory input? These network reconfigurations suggest an amplified internal mental stream that may occur alongside suppression of external sensory input. Um, and then it's the key findings from it were increased connectivity. Uh, studies using the fMRI um, have found stronger hubs, quote unquote, and increased connectivity between those, you know, the posterior and the dorsal anterior cingulate um, and the left insula. These areas are involved in self-referential thought, again, and internal awareness. There is a co-activation between the PCC, a default mode network, and the DACC and insula, which are, um, this suggests coordinating Coordinated brain response that amplifies internally oriented thought processes, decreased sensory processing. So it shows that this is why individuals can become less aware of repetitive external stimuli, such as drumming. Um, and then the perceptual decoupling from the external environment allows or more allows for more focus on internal thought and potentially allows for insights and integrations to occur from external source. Yeah. So what you're, you're talking about the you know the drumming like i mean yes. we're going so this is exactly mm -hmm. what i was talking about with hypnosis about how you're trying to overload this critical mind with yep you are sitting and hearing it repeating over and over and over again right you know like they do in shamanic trance and stuff that's the that's to get to theta it says no it says in, um, induction methods are monotonous drumming four to seven beats per second and that four to will, seven beats per second ridiculously fast and so but get this this is the crazy part this is something when i was reading this i was like what this is nuts to me. I, I love this so much. 